Father, the sleeper has awakened! If only I could call this planet Dune and try to say it as Ka Con... Kanita? Kanita? No. Kana... Kanatia. Kanatia. It's either planet Kanatia or something. I'm just gonna call it Dune. I just wish there were sandworms in this level. I also love, as of now, this is the only Bomberman planet in this nebula or galaxy that actually has, like, a secondary sun, or at least some sort of sun to perform like a day-night cycle. Cause, oh my god, I'm going on the semantics of Bomberman planets. Let's just move on. Just move on. Alright, Area 1, the love... Lava Nan? Lava Na. Lava Na. Lava Na Volcano. <laughs> Alright, Hades Crater. <laughs> It is so hot, my life meter is getting low. <laughs> this baby can take up temperatures up to 9,000 degrees! <laughs> when your life meter gets low, enter the cooling capsule. It looks like an inverted pyramid. Nah, it's not an inverted pyramid, it's more like a weird little pyramid shaped thing. Marvin's <laughs> like, yeah, whatever. This is nothing. I play off bombs all day. Volcano's not gonna kill me. Woohoo! Yeah, jumps into an active volcano. <laughs> and now we have the bomber chopper. Ah, uh, yeah. So I actually went back to Gro um, Groog Hills and finally five that. Destroy the garden. The gar- the Garadin control towers, open the exit door. Yeah. Now, this level is actually the best level to farm gems. You get a boatload of them. So, we'll actually be harvesting gems in this stage. Whenever I need to do some off-camera grinding, because, let's face it, this game is gonna crash. And when it crashes, I'm gonna sit there and go, No! And it'll be super sad and depressing. For me, at least. Not for y'all, because y'all won't see it. Well, you'll actually see my blunders. And that's it. Just my blunders. Nothing else. I wonder at what point when Barman jumped into the active volcano, he was like, Oh, right! I have the bomber pitch! And it's... And then, <laughs> dead. That's the satisfying sound of a flame four that we want. Also, the easiest one up in the game. Ow. I say that as I get singed. Alright. Alright, Magma Lake, which means. I think this is the straightforward level, and then Magma Dam has the, um, the separating path, because Crystal Hole is, the, is the, um, the next bomber pitch level that we get. Is this the one I think it is? Is it the one that crashes the game? It's the one that crashes the game! Of course it does. Of bloody fucking course it does. Oh, sweet Jesus Christ. Okay. We're back. I'm back. I don't... Anyone watching... If anyone can tell me how to make this game stable to the point where I'm not having to constantly redo shit that I've already done because of crashes, by all means, comment below. Just do that for me. Just... God. Alright, so this is one of those levels that... Yeah, okay. So this is our first lava level. Pretty much we have to constantly go inside these cooling chambers or else we just, we die. The nice thing is, is that it's a really cheap way to kind of like, give ourselves life. Ooh, okay, just gonna... Ow. What? 
No, it's not one of those awesome environmental levels where it's honestly just kind of like you really do feel the imprints. Oh, fuck the turtles. I say that as the known. Oh, shh. Get in the chamber. Get in the chamber, Bomberman. <laughs> oh, that would have been horrible. The life up power up just seems kind of pointless. Yeah, absolutely pointless. Ow! Hmm. Mario's must. Mario has a has has lethal lava land. We need a lethal lava land level. So you mean we know something just like volcanoes that shoot out the top in the bully system? Yes, exactly. What are we gonna do instead? We could have Bomberman's health slowly deplete as his time goes down. Brilliant! Yeah, it's. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. It's. It's. Yeah. It's just. Just. Yeah. Okay. I guess I'm gonna have to save state after every <laughs> magma dam. Okay. If you destroy the dam, the box will disappear, revealing the item inside. Oh right. So there are. Kobe? Kobe, get down. Kobe, get down. Co- Cat, off- off desk. Off desk. Off the- oh my god. Kobe, you little shit. Like I said, you stay there, and you think about what you've done, Kobe. You do not climb on daddy's desk, especially while Seth is recording. My boyfriend's cat, ladies and gentlemen. Um- so, <laughs> cats. That's all I can say. Now my mind is completely turtle. Slow down. Oh sh. Okay. So when I was a kid, I originally thought destroying the dam meant you had to like blow up that red generator thing, you know, like Star Wars. But no, it's literally just you see that really off section of the yeah. Lava will spout if a bomb hits the dam. Yeah, this area. That's all you do! That's all you do! I didn't know that as a kid. I didn't put two and two together until I tried to go back, like, a month later as a kid and go, Oh, that's why I couldn't get to this area. And I was like an idiot. Golly gee willikers, we might actually see f five units of health again after the amazing blunder that happened last time. As much as I want to try the trick I learned about from, um, from AGDQ one year, I don't think I can. Because those runners were playing the Japanese version of this game, and I don't know if there's, like, tips, tricks, and secrets that I'm just not aware of. Alright. So, we'll... Alright, we'll take... We'll take the exit behind the barricade for the first time, and then I guess we'll try the, uh... We'll try the other method. Oh my god, slow down. Ah, stupid turtle! Wow, I've never noticed how bad the slowdown was in this level. Ooh, okay, there we go. The game knows what's up when it's not being bombarded by things constantly. Nice try. Also, you stand there long enough, you will get the uh, the animation of Bomberman just smiling and being cute. All right. Yay! 
Alright. Now that should mean that... Alright. That was really close. Oh no, Emerald 2 was the uh, the bomber pitch level. Crystal Hole is just a different level altogether. Okay, let's... Let's find a cooling tower... Like now. Alright. Now I don't know if I need to blow up both dams. Ow. We'll give that a shot. So that will get rid of that initial target. Ow. And then I, we need to blow up the second one to gain access to that area first and foremost. However, I'm gonna try a, a trick that I don't think's gonna work at all, but we're gonna give it a shot. So it's like we jump. Oh, jeez. Okay, no, this is going horribly wrong. How did they? Oh no. Even when you die, you get that annoying tick-tock sound. Ah. Oh, no, 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 no. Come on, get your momentum and jump the gap. Alright, Crystal Hole. Or Krista Hole. Krista! <laughs> Rejected Pokemon. Honestly, the rejected Pokemon were Carabooms. Ugh. <laughs> I don't know, I honestly like the Caraboom system from Bomberman. From Bomberman Tournament, Bomberman Generation. They're cute, and they actually gave you some pretty worthwhile abilities. There we go. Oh, hey, slimes. Wait, you just not noticed the slimes? You've been killing them! Yeah, yeah. Oh, hi! Hi, hi, hi! Die, die, die. I especially love how there's no indication, like, where exactly in the hole you need to get Bomberman to jump into, but whatever. Bomberman knows these things. He's... Why aren't you dying, Mr. Tanman? There we go. By the way, so we had the Sally Whiplash guys, I'm now calling the pointy nose enemies, like, Dick Dastardly. Too bad we don't have a Mutt-type enemy. Oh, hi! That's rather forceful. Are you... Okay, Bomberman, it's okay. You know, I, I really didn't feel like jumping there. Ow! That hurt, and that wasn't very nice. That wasn't nice at all. We did it! We found our way into the alcove! Oh, sh- <laughs> well, That would've been embarrassing. That would've been super embarrassing. Yay! There's an attic bomb on this level? <laughs> I mean, of course I knew that. There, I know where all the attic bombs are. That's actually probably incredibly true. I could do the attic bombs no issue. It was, it was more like trying to five everything. It was the main struggle of this game for me.